Uh, it's Big Mike Collins there. Well, you got a little bit of... Yeah, hello there, sports fans. You got a little bit of me, plus Neil's in the center couch, and Buzz is doing the camera work this time. 34 hours into the flight, the crew of Apollo 11 took to television for a tour of their spacecraft. Is uh, Buzz holding your cue cards for you, over? Mike Collins described for viewers how the crew was settling into their home, now 129,000 nautical miles from Earth. competing with the professionals. We are very comfortable up here, though. We do have a happy home. Uh, there's plenty of room for the three of us, and uh, I think uh, we're all learning to find our favorite little corner to, uh, to sit in. The zero G is very comfortable, but uh, after a while, you get to the point where you sort of get tired of rattling around and banging off the ceiling and the floor and the side, so you, uh, you tend to find a little corner somewhere and put your knees up or something like that to wedge yourself in, and that seems more at home. Yeah, Neil's standing on his head again. He's trying to make me nervous. He then shared with the television audience the unique experience of dining in space. Well, looks like it's probably almost your dinner time down there, Earth. We'll uh, show you our food cabinet here in a second. 11, Roger. 11, Houston, we see a box full of goodies there, over. Oh, we really have them, Charlie. We got all kinds of good stuff. We've got coffee up here in the upper left, and uh, various uh, breakfast items, uh, bacon uh, in little small bites, and uh, beverages like uh, fruit drink. And over in the center part, we have uh, oh, all kinds of things. Let me pull one out here and see what it is. Right. Would you believe you're looking at uh, chicken stew here? All you have to do is three ounces of hot water for five or ten minutes. Now we get our our hot water out of a little spigot up here with a, uh, a filter on it that, that filters any gases that may be in the drinking water out. And uh, we just stick the, uh, the end of this little tube in the end of the spigot and uh, pull the trigger three times for three ounces of hot water and then mush it up and uh, slice the end off it, and there you go. Bye. Next, Collins demonstrated the operation of the spacecraft's display keyboard, or DISCI, the device used by astronauts to interface with the command module's onboard computer. That's, we see a real display now. Approximately 30 minutes since the television transmission began, Neil Armstrong radioed Houston to advise that the crew was signing off. 11, Houston, you copy over. I do a copy. And, uh, as, uh, we pan back out to, uh, the distance at which we see the Earth, we'll have Apollo 11 signing off. Roger, Paul 11. Thank you much for the uh, show. It's a real good half hour. Appreciate it. Thank you very much, Al. This is Apollo Control at uh, 34 hours, 46 minutes. Apollo 11 is presently 131,000 nautical miles from Earth, traveling at a speed of about 4,300 feet per second. During the next hour or so, the uh, activity here in Mission Control will be uh, revolving around getting the crew set up for their rest period and eat period. Uh, this will be a very long rest period tonight, scheduled 10 hours. And that uh, will begin, uh, according to the flight plan, at about 37 hours ground elapsed time. At uh, 34 hours, 48 minutes, this is Apollo Control, Houston.